Good morning, everybody. Edwin here. Uh, so I am down in Florida, staying at my family's um, timeshare uh, in the Orlando area. Uh, so I decided to, uh, you know, make the most of it and finally get out on a party boat down here in, or in Orlando. Uh, drove a little over an hour uh, down to get to the uh, where the uh, Orlando Princess and the uh, Canaveral Princess are located. I'm going to head out on a full day Canaveral Princess party boat. We'll see how that goes. It uh, should be a fun day no matter what. Uh, even if I don't catch anything that I can bring home uh, to enjoy, it should still provide uh, some good action and catch a whole bunch of new species I've never caught before uh, or ever targeted before while I'm down here. So um, uh, about to uh, finish loading up on the uh, boat. Uh, it's gonna steam out probably about an hour to two hours out before we start fishing. Uh, and then uh, we'll see how it goes, all right? So uh, stay tuned and I'll see you right out on the boat. Second spot. Try a different rig, see if we can't catch something we can take home. I'll take some grunts. Never had those. I hear they're pretty tasty, even though they use them for bait here, but one man's trash and another man's treasure. Let's hook up to something. What is it? Uh, oh, red snapper? Is that a red? <laughs> yeah. Red snapper. Oh, buddy. Stuck his tongue out at you. Yeah. Made him throw up. Something small on. Let's see what it is. <laughs> Little black sea bass? Is that what that is? Is that another red? No, it's, it's a vermilion. Little guy. Hey boss, these are the vermilion snappers? Yes. How big they gotta be? They're gonna be 12. 12? I, that looks like maybe 10. Oh! oh. Yeah. Wow, yeah, okay. Close, all right. <laughs> Ain't that right, Mr. Ritter? Yes, you damn skipping. Right. 
feels a little more substantial. It's probably a red. Yep. Oh, vermilion and a red. Jeez. <laughs> Double header. Barney, that's who built that rod. Whoa, flounder. Flounder. Nice little flounder. Alright guys, jump back down. Might be a red. Maybe. Whoa. Pull some drag. Whoa. This might be red. It's got no no, it's two different fish there. It's probably red snappers. Got some good weight to him. Whoa, this one's digging down. There it is, it's got color. Big, big red snapper. Oh my God. Damn. Oh. <laughs> Got big snapper here. I don't know, I can just pull that up. Ooh. Big red. Oh, came off. <laughs> Little hook too. That was a little small hook I had. I'm surprised he came all the way up. Yeah. It's another one on. Not sure what this is. Doesn't feel like a red. There he is. I got two on. No, just the one. Another red. Oof. God. Nice, beautiful reds. Oh, 
Oh, what was oh my rod tip. Oh my god. Clean off. Son of a bitch. God damn. Did it just come off or did no, it? No, no, it snapped. Oh, it snapped. Yeah. yeah. And just got a nice bite, too. What happened? Rod tip broke. A rod tip? Yeah. Oh, man. Not ideal, but uh, I'm gonna throw it right back out there. I mean, I'll fish with it like that. Catch a nice fix, fish, don't fix it. <laughs> oh, my bait's getting scared. Something might be on it. It's going nuts. Oh, there it is. Probably a red. Should be interesting without a rod tip. <laughs> Just digging, 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 digging. Come on. Wow. Can I come underneath you? Yeah. I'm gonna try to follow this thing up. See where this thing goes. Wow. All right, around the corner. Is that a red? Yeah. Oh, and you broke the eye. Fuck. Yeah, I know. Oh, dear. It was big. Stuck the pot. That's no good. Is that a gig? Yeah. Gotcha. He's still on there. Oh. It just popped off. It just popped free. Nope, still. It might be somebody. I don't know. Damn, that was big. I don't know. I, I... Was it breaking out? Did you lose him? Uh, it's it's kind of it's, it's someone's got me over yeah. there. That's the problem. I think we're, I think we're Man, I don't know what that was, but I don't think it was a big red. I, I think it was something been, else. I, mean, I had live bait on. I had live bait on. That might have been a nice grouper. Yeah. Damn. Got a fish on there too. Keep reeling. Keep reeling. All right, you're good. Keep going. Going. Pull it up here. Pull it up here. Come on, come on. 
Keep going. I thought I lost it. No, nah, I was just hooked onto another one over there. How big the gas got to be here? 24 inch. Going all the way to the corner. Should I go over there? Coming around, isn't it? Here, watch the clock off. Oh, it's red. It's a big red? Yeah, uh, big ass red. Oh, shit. Damn. Boy, there's a big red in this spot. I yeah. can't believe it. I wish I'd been something else, but it's all right. Let me get a picture with that one before I throw it back yeah. if I can. Oh, look at all the tangle mess I got there. Jeez. Yeah, I'll show you where you're braided. Yep. What are you, two different people's shit? <laughs> Man, that's a big fish. Damn. Grip right in here. See what I mean? Yep. Can take a picture this way? Sure. <laughs> awesome. Oh. I was going to pop his belly in the Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. Okay. Got him. There you go. Nice. Fun fight. Another big red. We just got back uh, to land. Uh, it was a two hour ride out, two hour ride back in. Unfortunately, uh, for these types of trips, you do have to go out far. Uh, I'm sure if the uh, captain and crew could go out shorter, they, they would, uh, could be less gas. But unfortunately, the fish are further offshore, uh, you know, and you gotta go out there and get them. Um, so, but I already expected that. Um, I had a fun time, great time. I ended up catching five new different species of fish. I uh, caught a southern flounder, a uh, vermilion snapper, uh, caught red snapper. Uh, I did manage to catch a grunt, which I don't think I got on video, but I did catch a grunt. And some other unidentified fish, it, it had like some nice colorings on there. Uh, I, I caught like two of those. Uh, even the mates weren't sure what, what they were exactly. But uh, either way, five new species. Um, it was a lot of fun. Uh, and you know what? The red snapper made the trip worthwhile. Uh, those fish fight hard, and I couldn't believe how many there were out there and uh, how much fun it was to catch them. Um, but so just in case, if you, any of you are ever wondering, coming out here in the month of August, which is where uh, the time of year that I'm in right now, uh, the bottom fishing is tough. Uh, now, there is still stuff to catch, but it's not like it's banner fishing that you're going to take home a cooler full of fish or anything like that. Uh, but it is still fun fishing. It's a fun uh, whole day outing kind of thing. And again, just a red snapper alone was worth it. There were a couple of sharks caught uh, uh, on the boat. There was a big remora caught as well. And uh, I think a couple of kingfish were hooked up, but they, they, they came off. And there was a one large uh, bonita or false albacore as we know them. So there's a variety out here. So it can still be a fun day for you if you want to come out. Um, I probably want to do one of these trips again, but I have to wait until a year or two before I do it again. Uh, so we'll see. <laughs> but I had a great time. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, made the most of it while I was down here. Uh, again, hey, if, and if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, hit that like button. All that helps my channel grow. And I will catch you on the next one. Tight lines.